Good morning, everybody. This is Dr. Nandi. Today I'm back again. I'm going to talk about complex numbers. So without further ado, I'll share my screen with you. Complex numbers. There are two problems. Part one is simplify four divided by three plus two i, where i stands for the imaginary or complex number, which is equal to square root of minus one. And then the second problem is evaluate x square minus two x plus 12, when x is equal to one minus two i. So we'll do the first problem, four divided by three plus two i, we will multiply by the conjugate, which is three minus two i in the numerator and three minus two i in the denominator. So the numerator, then we distribute the four, it becomes four times three, 12 minus four times two, eight i. Divided by, we use the formula for a plus b times a minus b, which is a square minus b square. So a is three, so three square is nine minus b is 2i, which is 4i square. So in the numerator, we still have 12 minus 8i divided by 9 minus 4i square is minus 1. So we can substitute minus 1 for i square. And in the denominator, we get 9 minus 4 times minus 1. So the denominator then reduces to 12 minus 8 i in the numerator divided by nine plus four, which is 13. So eventually it transforms to 12 divided by 13, the first term minus eight divided by 13 i. That is the simplified form of four divided by three plus two i. Now we have to value of the function when x is equal to one minus two i. So for x, we are going to substitute one minus two i in the function and we get one minus two i square minus two times one minus two i plus 12. So we write a minus b whole square is a square minus two ab plus b square. So my a is one, one square is one. My b is minus two i or just i, two i, which is square, <clears throat> two i square is four i square minus two ab. So minus two times one is two, again, two minus four i, okay? So my b part is two i, a part is one. So my two ab is minus four i. Then I distribute the minus two in the next term. So minus two times one is minus two, minus two times minus two i, two minuses make it a plus, plus four i, plus 12. Then we cancel the minus four i with the positive four i. Minus four i plus four i is canceled out. So we are left with one plus four i square minus two plus 12. Now, again, I told you before i square is minus one. So it is one plus four times minus one minus two plus 12, which is one minus four minus two plus 12, or 13 minus six is seven. So that is the value of the function when x is equal to one minus two i. So i is the imaginary number, which is square root of minus one. And this type combination of uh, imaginary number, which is i and a regular number is called a complex number. Like for example, one minus two i, okay. Will be a combination of real numbers and complex numbers. So. I will stop here today. If you have any question, please write me a comment. I'll reply to your comment as soon as possible. And thanks for watching. And please subscribe to my channel because I come back every week to solve problems in math. I want to help you to become successful in math. So please subscribe to my channel by hitting the red subscribe button at the right corner, bottom corner of the screen. Thanks for watching. Take care. Have a nice time. I'll see you next time.